Kwa muda wa miongo mitano shirika la umoja mataifa linaloshughulikia mazingira UNEP limekuwa mstari wa mbele katika kuangazia masuala ya uhifadhi wa mazingira kote duniani. Ileo shirika hilo limeadhimisha miaka 50 ya kuepo kwake. Maadhimisho haya katika makao makuu ya UNEP yalihudhuriwa na Rais Uhuru Kenyatta, Rais Mohamed Buhari wa Nigeria na Rais Mokwetsi Eric Masisi wa Botswana. Rais Kenyatta amepongeza UNEP kwa kazi nzuri ya kupigania mazingira bora hasa wakati huu ambapo ulimwengu unakabiliwa na majanga mbalimbali yanayotokana na mabadiliko ya tabia nchi. I want to commend and congratulate all member states for the dedication and diligence that you have shown towards prioritizing this real issue that affects our planet. UNEP ni muungano wa mataifa 175 ulioanzishwa mwaka 1972. Aidha makao makuu yake hapa jijini Nairobi ilianzishwa mwaka 1996. Over the last 50 years, UNEP has led the world to understand the centrality of environment in human existence, to appreciate the increased threats to the environment and also the existential threat that exists to our planet. Sherehe hizi zinawadia siku moja tu baada ya kongamano kukamilika. Dan Kaburu K24 Samoja Founded in June 1972 following the United Nations Stockholm Conference on Human Environment, the Nairobi-based UNEP is charged with coordinating the United Nations environmental activities. And today, it was a time for the UNEP to mark 50 years of hard work looking back to achievements shortcomings and challenges. President Uru Kenyatta who led Nigeria and Botswana president to mark the day at UNEP headquarters congratulated UNEP for the role it has played in guiding the world on matters and environment, especially now that the world is grappling with climate crisis. I want to commend and congratulate all member states for the dedication and diligence that you have shown towards prioritizing this real issue that affects our planet. UNEP has 175 member countries. Its Nairobi headquarters was set up in 1996. Over the last 50 years, UNEP has led the world to understand the centrality of environment in human existence, to appreciate the increased threats to the environment and also the existential threat that exists to our planet. The two-day UNEP at 50 celebrations are being held a day after a historic landmark agreement, which is a win for the people and the planet, where nations committed themselves to develop a legally binding agreement on plastic pollution. UNEP has established a credible platform for countries to come together and act boldly to advance the global environment agenda. I commend the leadership of the United Nations and the UNEP family for successfully steering the environmental ship through troubled waters and remaining steadfast and focused in implementing your core mandate. Dan Kaburu, K24, Evening Edition.